Hello and welcome to Tech. I am Mohammad Adnan and in this video we are going to discuss about filter versus filter DAX in Microsoft Power BI. If you are new to this channel or if you haven't subscribed yet, please click on the subscribe button and also press the bell icon to get the latest notification. Now let's get started. So this is the comparison chart between the filter and filters. DAX function in Power BI. We'll go one by one. The filter returns a table that represents a subset of another table or expression. The syntax is filter, the table name, comma, the filters. An example is filter, gender table, is a table name, and gender table, bracket gender equal to male, is a filter. So in this example, it filters the male gender from the gender table and given table, I mean returns a table. Okay. Whereas in filters, returns the value that are directly applied as filters to column name. Syntax is filter column name. Example is filters gender table gender. This will return the unique values in that particular column of the table. Now let's see it in practical. I open this Power BI in this data tab. I have table like gender table. In this, I have genders like male, female, and others. There's a count, a state, and year. I want to use this filter function. So in the modeling tab. Click on new table. Give it a name. Gender table two. Filter returns a table that has been filtered. First, it is asking for table name, gender table. Come on, filter expression. Now we need to use this expression filter. So what I will do is I'll put it as gender table gender is equal to male. If you want to search for others, you can also do that. The use of this function is if you want to compare between the genders in this example the male and female and others we will give in three separate columns we want to compare the others to male or female then you can do this one the next is the filters again i will go to this one model tab new table give it a name Gender filters. The formula is filters returns the table of the filter values applied directly to the specified column. I need the gender table. Gender. It will give me the distinct values inside this column of the gender table male, female, and others. So this is the difference between these two. It returns the distinct value of a specified column in filters, whereas in filter, it returns the table but with the filter option. The best use of these two functions is let's have a look at that. So go to this visualization tab and I want to add the relationship between these three tables. So new. Gender filters is a main table here now. So gender table one to many. K add another. Gender filter. Gender table two other. Okay. So I'm clicking on okay now. 
what I will do is I'll just click on this one gender and I want to add the count to gender table as well as the gender table too. If you look at this example, this gender is from the filter function which returns the unique values from the gender table itself. The first column is a base general table, gender table, and the third column is the filter function which we are used only to filter the others. If you have a look at this one, okay. Now what I will do is instead of using the gender here, I want to show as a state in AP state total is sixteen thousand out of the. 350 is the other gender. If you select the TN state, the total is 15,000. Out of that, others are 800. Whereas in UP state, total is 29,500. Others is 500. Same as if you want to compare the sales of United States versus the rest of the world, or if you want to compare the profit in the Asia compared to the rest of the world, you can use this filter function easily by using this so this way you can able to use the filter and filter stacks function in power bi if you like this video please click on the big thumbs up button if you are new to this channel or if you haven't subscribed yet please click on the subscribe button and also press the bell icon to get the latest notification but make sure you turn on the notification on your devices if you have any queries feedback please post it on the comment section below share it with your friends and colleagues thanks for watching keep learning see you in the next video